Well, hello YouTube. Hope you enjoyed that little short speeded up version of setting up camp. But uh, I got my ECS essential carry system from uh, Primal Outdoors and Jason. <laughs> This is the new and improved version. I have the old version. You've seen that me use that in, in several videos, and I just love the system. I think the system is fantastic. But as much as I love the old system, the new system just, just blows me away. It really does. So I keep getting, I, I put a picture of, uh, of it unboxing on, on Facebook, and many of them ask what's the load capacity and all this other stuff. So I overloaded the pack just to show you what the capability is. Um, you can actually carry enough for a two or three night stay, really, if, if you wanted to. So let me uh, spread everything out and we'll talk about what I got in the pack. You see a tarp, it's a seal nylon tarp with a hammock behind me. I mean, that was in the pack, you saw me take it out. And uh, I'll show you what else is in the pack. Here's the pack. And once I empty it out, and uh, then I will I will show you some of the features of it, but this is a an Italian 100% wool blanket. And it just comes. I just strapped it into these these straps here. It's on the expansion pack that was on my back. You can put a jacket in there, a tarp, um, rain gear, whatever you want to do. Okay, but I, I just wanted to show you what that it was capable of carrying. A full-size blanket okay and it has another little pouch here on the back and all these zippers are the uh, uh, the YKK zippers I mean this is uh, Cordura I think is what the material is I'm not sure but I'll put a link in the description below so that you can go to his his uh, YouTube channel and uh, and he has all the specs on there and uh, so but anyway, uh, I just got a, a Sawyer water filter in there now. But I mean, it's a fairly sized pocket. See, my whole hand fits in there. So that's an option that you can carry in there. I had a, uh, a saw. Let's see, I might have to get all this in there. Okay, I had a saw in there. I've got a... Uh, and a military style poncho for rain gear. I've got uh, a, a compactable down vest in there. And those are wonderful, by the way. I think I got that one at Sam's or somewhere. It might have been... Um, I'm not sure. Anyway, sh shop around. If you see one of those, those packable down vests, get you one. Because they're, they're awesome. My, my light kit... I've got uh, some extra batteries in there and a couple of couple of lights. Um, this is the Princeton uh, Tactical, and uh, I got an extra boat plug and some other things and batteries and stuff in there. And of course, the ever-present 55-gallon drum liner. Okay. Now, what is really so? Oh, there's another pouch under here that you could put uh, compasses or whatever you want to do and put in there and uh, it's just another storage pouch it's pretty much water resistant uh, but what really sold me on the whole setup is this right here this water bottle carrier on the back and it is ingenious for what he did this is of course sewn onto the bottom of the expansion pack but it has a zipper here that you can unzip because we all carry cups in our water bottle and you can get to it just like that so i have a cup a cook kit water bottle all in one right there okay so that's what i had in the expansion pack i had all of this i had the the hammock i had the hammock and the tarp in this expansion pack that's this i mean it's just anything you would need on a, on a one or two day 
uh, hike or a scout, and you had, still had plenty of room to put some food in there, little food packets if you wanted to. Okay. Okay. In this pocket, I've got my um, woods kit, and if you want to know what's inside there, then look in my uh, my videos, and, and it's the new and improved woods kit. That's what that is. Okay. And you still have plenty of room in there for something else if you wanted to. And on this side. I have a pistol, and I know somebody's going to ask. This is the MP shield, the, the Smith & Wesson MP shield, 9mm, and I've got an extra 8-round clip in this side pocket just for protection. So that is what was all in the vest and in the expansion pack, in addition to that. So I just want to kind of give you a brief uh, overview of this expansion pack because I will be wearing it in many videos and I'm sure that there's going to be somebody ask what is that you're wearing and I can just copy and paste a link to this video to it. <laughs> See there, planning ahead. I don't do that very often. Um, but anyway, I really love this thing. I, I, I do and I'm, I just got it. Um, right now this loadout with water in my water bottle is probably pushing 20 to 25 pounds and it gets to be a little bit uh, heavy on the shoulders when you get up to that weight but uh, there's lighter materials that you could take to uh, to offset that the wool blanket probably weighs seven pounds in itself I mean so you could get away with something besides a wool blanket unless you're in a cold climate then you probably want a, a larger pack to carry you your some other uh, some other items. So, but anyway, this is uh, this is a perfect little thing for a a boating trip or a uh, scout or like I say, one or two day uh, hunt. Um, you could you could pretty much carry everything you needed in that one pack. So, Jason, as usual, buddy hit the ball out of the park it's a great system and uh, like I say I'll put a link uh, below so that you can uh, visit Jason's channel awesome channel in itself uh, does a lot of hunting and, and uh, outdoor stuff and I love that so just a great great guy so if you're not subscribed to him subscribe to him um, and uh, if you if you could use a system like this by all means explore the options the reason I got this system, and I said this in the other video, is because I hunt in, in stands, in climbing stands, and I always have gear, and I can't wear a belt for my gear because it, it, it always hitting the sides of the stand and clanking, and, and deer don't like a lot of noise. <laughs> so I figured if I had this, then I could put little, little things in my, in my vest, and uh, I could... Uh, it would be better for me bow hunting and, and deer hunting. So, and it proved last year to be exceptional. And so when I saw this, the new little deal for the water bottle and everything, I said, I've got to get me one of those. So got some more in and Jason uh, uh, got one to me. So um, uh, pricing, um, I don't want to say what the pricing is because I don't remember off the top of my head, but uh, I will. it will be in the link below. Um, uh, just visit his site and uh, all the information would be there. Okay? Appreciate you joining me on this. And um, until the next one, you guys get out in the woods. Go out in the backyard, whittle on a stick. Take a child, we teach that child how to whittle on a stick. And if you do, take plenty of band-aids and lots of knives. We'll catch you again soon.